Well, good morning. It is currently 4.48 in the morning on February 10th, I believe. Let me turn this light on. Mm. I'd pick up the GoPro today, film a little day in the life. It is a Saturday. I haven't done one of these in quite some time, but uh, yeah, it's going to be a pretty fun day. <laughs> Hopefully, we'll see how it goes. But the reason why I'm up so early is because the pool opened at 6 and Masters is at 7 and I want to get a swim in before Masters so I can get on my bike by 8, 8, 8.30 and so I can be done biking by 1 so I can run with my friend Nolan and then be done training by around 2.30 and be in the sauna by 2.31. <laughs> we'll see how today goes. But yeah, we got uh, the swim today. Um, I'm gonna do a short swim. Probably won't even be 3K. I'm already at 20,000 yards for the day, or not for the day. It's early for the week. Um, yeah, so we'll see how I feel once I get in the water. That will kind of depend. Saturdays are kind of like a free day. Um, my coach kind of gives me a workout if I want to, or I can join Masters at seven if I want to, or I can just do my own thing. So today, yeah, we'll see how I feel when I get in the water. Yeah, I'm actually swimming with the master swim coach. Um, he said he may join. And then we got a pretty fun bike workout. Actually, I was supposed to do last week, but I was sick last week, so I um, didn't do it. But it's, uh, I say it's fun now. I've been looking forward to it for two weeks. But you guys will have to wait and see what it is until we get there. And then the run is just an easy eight mile run. Um, we may throw in some hill strides. Uh, but it will be outside, although tomorrow's 18 miler will be um, on the treadmill because it's going to be like 30 degrees at 8 a.m. That's what happens when you live in Chicago. Oh well. Anyway, I am currently on the computer. Uh, I got to do some athlete check ins and whatnot. So I'm going to go do this, get some food in me. And then we'll probably catch you next time at the pool. Oh, wait, I got to plug my channel. Go ahead, hit that subscribe button. Uh, I'm not sure when I'm posting this. Uh, I'll probably post it relatively soon, actually. So Ironman Texas is between 9 and 12 weeks out, depending on when you're seeing this. <laughs> um, yeah, so stay tuned. I'm going to be uh, filming lots of training footage. Much more of these day in the lives, week in the lives videos, so it should be a good one. All right. Got my bottles all ready to go. These are the two bottles I have with carbs in them. And I'm also going to try this bar out actually right now. It is a Innervit protein bar. I got it on thefeed.com link in the description box below um it's kind of a protein bar it has some carbs so i'm not gonna be taking it on the bike but i thought i'd try it out before uh triple chocolate Pretty good. A little chewy, but eight out of ten. All right, now it's time to go to the pool. Uh, how you feeling? Uh, you never get enough sleep. It's good. <laughs> <laughs> Three three hundreds? Three three, huh? And four, yeah, I'll see. If I'm feeling good, I'll do two twos and one one after, but Ooh. that's only that's actually better. <laughs> only, <laughs> only if these go well. Uh, Alright. Go on the bottom? Yeah. Let's do it. What are you guys doing? Three threes. 
doing 450s press row. <laughs> I'm three minutes. Yeah. We'll go at the same time. That'll be good. This water is warming up as we swim. <laughs> I agree. We are firing up Zwift. I'm about to get this party started. I'm going to turn on some lights. Uh, swim went okay. Uh, ended up doing 300, two 200s, and three 100s. Um, still feeling a little bit of fatigue, but much better than yesterday. Now onto the bike. Oh boy, do we have a good one today. We have, it's only three rounds, but each round, well, the first round is three by 20 minutes. Then the second round is three by, no, not three by 20 minutes, 20 by three minutes, then 20 by two minutes, and then 20 by one minute. Um, we have one minute recovery between each of it, each of the intervals, and then 15 minutes between each of the rounds. And the intervals shooting for 270 watts. Um, yeah, we'll see how that goes. Um, if I can hit that, I'll be very excited. And like I said, I've been pretty darn um, looking forward to this workout for quite some time, two weeks. I'm gonna start off on the uh, the road bike we have here, the Tax Neo bike. And then I think for the last bit, I'm gonna hop on the, uh, the Tiki bike and do them in aero position. But I don't want to put too many miles on that bike because it's my race bike. So trying to keep it as fresh as possible, but it is important to get some practice in, um, yeah, in aero. So that's why I'm doing that. Carbs are ready. Got some pop tarts in here. Uh, trying out two, uh, some Vel Forte energy chews, a gel, and I got about 200 grams of carbs in bottles. So I'm shooting for around 450 to 500 grams of carbs during this ride. It'll be just, uh, it'll be between four and a half and five hours. So yeah, let's get it started. The warm up is just about done. Fans are blowing, cheering us on. Gonna have some quick carbs and then we'll get into it. Got two minutes left till the main set. First round is 20 by three minutes at 270 watts with one minute easy in between each. So, yeah, luckily with this workout gets easier as it goes on um yeah so if i can get this one out of the way then hopefully the rest of it should go by relatively smoothly let's get it First round of 20 intervals. Um, wasn't too bad. Legs burned a little bit. I'm trying to do most of these big gears, so 60 to 65 RPM. Uh, yeah, definitely feel it, but got it done. So next up we have, uh, after this 15 minute easy, next up we have 20 by two minutes at 275 watts with one minute easy. So bumping it up by five watts, uh, but it's a minute shorter on the work interval. So I'm gonna get some more carbs in me and uh, yeah, keep it rolling. Hardest part done. Woo! We have made it to the TT bike which means we have made it to the last and final round. <laughs> 20 by one minute 
at 280 with one minute recovery. I'm gonna do these all in aero position. 20 by two minute wasn't too bad. Last year got a little tough. Um, yeah, I've already gone through like the 450 grams of carbs I laid out. So, and I felt a bump coming on. So I've uh, added another pop tart and some more carbs to the mix. So we are going all in. <laughs> but yeah, gonna knock this out. 40 minutes left, 20 minutes of hard work. And call the day. Performance can, or no, we still have to run an hour. But performance condition has gone from a negative three at the start to a plus one, so at least there's that. <laughs> Are you ready? All right, we made it outside. Um, supposed to run with Nolan today, but he ditched me. But luckily, I got Andrew to join me. Didn't want to run by myself today. Mr. Andrew Dixon, how are you feeling, Andrew? I'm feeling pretty good for uh, tenth of a mile. <laughs> there we go. How's your day been so far? It's been good. I got out for a, probably a two and a half kilometer swim this morning, and then a little warm up bike right before this. There we go. Yeah, I finished up uh, my bike ride. I'll put up all the stats on screen, but I think it's around five hours. Ended up eating like six or 700 grams of carbs. Um, legs actually feel pretty good. But now we have six miles easy. And then I may throw in a few hill repeats at the end of the run. We'll see. Um, but yeah, just getting in some miles on heavy legs, so. Whew. Anything else you want to say, Andrew? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing? <laughs> All right. Oh, wait, Andrew, I got a question. When are you going to join NVDM? <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm going to have to be a little faster for that. Yeah. I am a coach with NVDM. If you are looking for a coach, uh, quick little sponsor plug. Or not really sponsor plug coaching plug shoot me an email i'll have it in the description box below oh and this new jacket from nomadic uh code parker curse 10 to save well would you look at that the day is done we are in the sauna um, got my little at-home sauna here. You guys missed out on the sauna video. Check it out. I'll have a link somewhere in the description box. Oh, we'll see how much longer I can keep my eyes open. Salt is sweat. Um, but yeah, solid day. Just under seven hours, I think. Um, I'll put up some stats on the screen if I can remember. Um, run was relatively easy. Um, kind of started bonking at the end. Should have used, taken on more carbs. But we got it done. Threw in some hills. Um... Yeah, fun running with Andrew. Always makes the time go by faster when you're running with someone else. Oh boy, this is really getting salty. Oh. Okay, we got ourselves a towel. Shout out to mom, crisis averted. Uh, as I was saying, pretty solid day. Felt good on the bike. Felt uh, not bad in the swim. Yeah, still carrying a little bit of fatigue. Uh, next week will be better though, definitely. Um, and then the run, yeah, pretty, pretty, uh, subpar or not subpar but nothing special on the run uh tomorrow what do we have tomorrow tomorrow we have an 18 mile treadmill workout i think it's gonna be like 30 degrees when i start running and i don't like running in the cold so i don't know we'll see maybe i'll go outside i'll see how i feel when i get up but hope you guys enjoyed this day in the life video hopefully it's relatively short not super long um hopefully i can get it out actually tomorrow on sunday we'll see how long it takes me to edit uh, i gotta do a couple hours of work though to check in training peaks <laughs> So what happens when you spend the whole day training and then you have athletes training the whole day too. <laughs> um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys want to see next and we will catch you in the next one. Woo! 
seven reps down in the two, three, <laughs> 20 by two minutes. Can't stop going. Woo! Cheers. Got Mike and Sade blowing up my phone. I gotta give those fools harder workouts. <laughs>